Hi, good afternoon. I'm Ian Allen, President of the Trinidad and Tobago Crime Watch. We are back this afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Well, it's a rainy, 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 rainy day. But nevertheless, the show must go on. I'm, 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 I'm sure a lot of you, you know, got a kind of, uh, you know, a bit fed up of the reruns that we were having. But nevertheless, it was necessary. But I'm here and I'm live and I'm in studio. You don't believe me? You can call. As you know, as, as previously um, advertised, we would have... Um, we were supposed to be joined by the Imam Yassim Abu Bakr. We are still waiting um, his arrival. Nevertheless, I don't know if the incoming weather has somewhat um, kind of kept him back a couple minutes. But we, if you are somewhere close to him, let him know that we are waiting. Ladies and gentlemen, it's a beautiful, beautiful day today. You know, we, we want to discuss more, and I want to hear more from you with respect to the 1990 coup and the what exactly happened, how you describe the, the present inquiry, what's going on. If you, I mean, as you know, nothing can happen to the 114, the, those that were involved in the coup, the, the Jamaat, uh, you know, Muslimin, but we want to hear from you also. Remember, you can text me on 290-4426 also to all those that are locked on online on www.wintvworld.com. A special good evening. So we're going to take a break. When we come back, we're going to get the show started and hope Hope that the Imam can join us. All right, director, let's take a break. Okay. And. Okay, no problem, because we have started already. Beautiful. Thanks again. Oh, sorry, that was the Imam, Yassim Abu Bakr. Um, he's on his way. Ladies and gentlemen, before we go further, what I'd like to do, just to hear from you before we go, before we start, in fact, we should, we, we, we should be starting the interview with the Imam in a couple of minutes, but you know me. Whatever you see on national television, it's reality TV. So sometimes I might pick up my phone. That's me. That's why Crime Watch is hot. But tell me something this afternoon. How do you, de how do you describe the inquiry? How do you describe the coup? Uh, director, open up the lines for me. 665-6278. Hi, good evening. You're live on Crime Watch. Hi, my darling. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Yes, darling. I'm going to miss them days. I'm going to miss them. I'm feel you again, right? Your boy here, I'll, 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 I'm, I'm live. Yes, I know that. But, uh, Miss Allen, I would like them to eat, leave the imam alone, please. Because it has too much, too much controversy in the situation. And now they're coming up to say, but the man, they, they want more money from the man. And look how much time they put the man in jail without, you know, reason I can't at hear. All. What's happening? Director, we, 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 we're getting a problem with the audio. Don't. Hi, good evening. Yes. Go ahead. Yes, I say I find I should leave the imam now. You understand? Because it has too much controversy. Okay. You know, within this matter. You understand? And now all the jumping up and ball, he going all and all. He want to, to, to take the, the, the school and the, the mosque and all this kind of thing. The man had diabetes. Now he suffer all the payment jail and then he gets case and then come and dismiss. Okay, you thanks. Understand? Next caller, please. Beautiful. Next caller. Let me hear from you again. We're going to just take Hello. some Hi, good evening. You're live on Crime Watch. What's happening? Yeah, I beg to differ about that last caller. They should nail the imam to the cross. You can't, you can't play you holding the, the, the prime minister, the country hostage, and walking free. Is Trinidad insane? That is, that is, that is unbelievable. You know, that's insane. Thank you. Next, thank you. Thank you. 
Hi, good evening. You're, you're, um, could you get my help point in here, please, director? Could you send him in here for me, please? Hi, good evening. You're live on Crime Watch. Hello? Go ahead. Let's talk about the, 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 the coup. Come on. I find it sound really deep. But do I you know see, after the inquiry... I find it the judgment man alone because they're going on their way to taxpayers' money. You understand what I'm saying? Because do you know... Do you know, because of the amnesty and whatnot, that no matter who is to blame with respect to the, 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 what, what happened in the coup, the, those involved, the, 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 the Muslims that were involved in the coup, they cannot be charged? So, I mean, okay, we got, in Trinidad there is a policy. I mean, even though whatever inquiry comes out, it's just a waste of taxpayers' money because nobody will face the jail. I mean, if it is alleged that there were politicians that had prior, uh, prior knowledge of the, uh, of the uh, invasion at, at the Red House. I mean, nothing can really come out of that, you know. Because, that, I mean, it's, it's only in Trinidad that people don't face a jail. Once you're big, you're big. Next caller. Hi, good evening. You're live on Crime Watch. Uh, go ahead. Please hang up. Next caller, please. 665-6278. Hello? Hello, good afternoon, Mr. Ian. Good afternoon, go ahead. Go ahead, thank you. Do you know the labor, the harvest is ready, but the laborers are few, and how are you looking so handsome? Thank you, darling. But what is the harvest or the laborers? All right, next caller. Hi, good evening. You're live on Crime Watch. Hello? Hi, good evening. Hello. Good evening. Oh, good afternoon, Mr. Allen. Good evening. Hi, Mr. Allen. 